Hey y'all, it's me Trish. I am the Witch of the Dismal Swamp. How is everybody doing today? Alright, I am here to do a video that I wanted to share with y'all on an oil that's good for like body massages. Hint, hint. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> y'all. Let me show y'all how I'm going to make this oil, okay? It's for your mate and you when it's frisky time. <laughs> All right, y'all. Hold on. I'm going to flip you. All right. Here it is. Now, this is the fourth video I've made of this oil. And every time I get going, somebody calls me. Have you ever had that kind of day where it's like one day you get nobody wants to call you. And then all of a sudden that day, everybody calls you. Okay, that's what kind of day I'm having. All right, let's, um, I had to get it just right here, y'all. Okay, now first thing I'm going to show y'all is look at the triangle shape here I got with the candles, okay? To me, triangle represents strength, okay? It is unbreakable. That's how I look at this. Now, this oil that I'm making... I'm going to make for a couple other couples as well. And I am also making it for me. But this particular oil is, okay, my husband and myself have been married in July 40 years. And I've used a lot of, I've done a lot of spell work on our marriage. Because let me tell you, we've had our rough times too. And every one that I have ever done, I've used the triangle. And apparently it works because we've been 40 years in July. So therefore, I will always use a triangle when it comes to this. And I also got a triangle shape and rose quartz going the opposite. You know, these are going this way. My triangle for the rose quartz is going this way. So, let me show y'all what is in my oil. Now, this is something you can do however you want to do it. This is just the way that I'm doing it. You know, it's like I always tell you, you do you. And let me show you my daisies. I went out the other day and picked some. Look how pretty they are. They're just growing wild out there in the field. So, I had to bring some in. Well, anyway, that was one of my little side moments, y'all. <laughs> I'm really bad at that. All right, now let's get back to this. Okay, I used jojoba. I can't, I don't know if I say that correctly, but it's jojoba, jojoba, however you do it, say it. But this is the oil that I use for my carrier. You can use whatever you choose. You do you, baby. Uh, you can use coconut, grape, almond, whatever. As long as it's good for your body and your skin. That's what you want to use, okay? Now, I use jasmine, sandalwood, ylang-ylang, and rose as my essential oils. Now, again, you put whatever you choose. And if you choose these that I have, you put whatever one you want, you know, to be more prominent. You put, you know, you make it the way you want it to smell. Now, the way that I have it right now is it is real soft and subtle it's not slamming your face strong that's the way i like my oils to come out i don't like them to be overpowering um and then what else did i have in here i have got let me shake it so you can see it watermelon seeds in my oil as well i put seven in here because seven is a lucky number and I put some rose quartz chips in there as well. Now, right here is the watermelon and the rose quartz chips that I used. Now, let me explain to y'all the watermelon. Why did I put watermelon seeds in my oil? Well, uh, I don't know if y'all know this, but it's something I thought I would share with y'all. But the seeds are packed with zinc, okay? Zinc is helps testosterone production and sexual health. So it helps in that aspect, okay? It also helps with females as well. It's got citrulline in it. 
which is an amino acid that may support better erections. And it's on the line of Viagra. Okay, Viagra is made by man. It is made by chemicals. And what it is supposed to do is create the blood flow, which causes the erection. Okay, this is pure Mother Nature oil natural. Okay, you just eat your watermelon with the seeds in it. Don't spit the seeds out and have watermelon seed fights like I used to do. Um, swallow the seeds. They're good for you. They're full of zinc, which is good for you. It's good for your sexual health. Okay. And that is the reason why I put watermelon seeds in my oil. Now, you can do it if you want to do it. That's up to you. But you can also think about watermelons too. This just popped in my head. Think about a watermelon when it grows. It grows and it gets huge, right? Well, I picture that as like a baby in the womb. As the baby grows, your belly grows. Okay? Well, that's kind of like the way it is with the watermelon. So... What you can do, too, is take a piece of this once it is ripe and you're ready to eat it. Take a little piece of it and go give it back to Mother Earth, okay? Bless it and tell her thank you, okay? That's another thing that you can do. Or, hey, if you want to be that nice neighbor, go buy a watermelon and give it to your neighbor as a gift. Say, hey, this is just a friendship thing, man. Let's have a watermelon seed fight. <laughs> you know, that kind of good stuff. Bring people together, man. That's what I'm talking about. I want to see people come together, not come apart. All right. So anyway, this right here is a wonderful, wonderful thing to have. Even though they've gotten expensive, this is a little sidetrack thing here. But my husband bought this watermelon to give to our horse. And, of course, I eat it. I eat some of it before she gets it all. She gets most, most of it. But... Eight bucks for a freaking watermelon. I about had a shit fit. I said, what in the hell? Eight dollars for a watermelon. That is crazy. Well, I told him go ahead and get it anyway because, you know, got to give my horse her, her watermelon. And then I like to eat some of it myself. So therefore, you know, oh, well, you pay for it, right? If you want it, you got to buy it. You got to pay it. Anyway, that is the end of this video, y'all. I done ranted on too much. Let me just show y'all the card I drew for today. And I want y'all to tell me, what do y'all see in that card for me? Hmm? It's my daily draw. What do y'all see in it? Let me know. I know some readers out there. So tell me. All right. Y'all have a good day. I send y'all so damn much love. And please be safe out there. It's getting crazy. Much love, y'all. Toodles.